Towson football entering the final week of their 2012 fall camp. We're with tight ends coach James Volano. Coach, uh, the tight ends, they're, they're kind of a small group in terms of the positions around the, around the field, but you've got some talented guys in this group. Yeah, for the first time, we've built some depth. It's exciting to have multiple guys that you know you can play and rely on, uh, and it's something that I think we can rely heavily on this season. It's exciting. It certainly is. Tell me about their progression maybe from, from last year through the spring to this fall. Everyone knows that tight ends are not just pass catching guys, but they've got to be able to do some dirty work too. Right, absolutely. One of the big things that Coach Pick has done a tremendous job on is getting our guys bigger, faster, and stronger. And I mean, the strength and conditioning department here has just been through the roof. Uh, all of the tight ends have gotten all the above, bigger, faster, and stronger. And it's great to know that you're not having a 225, 225-pound freshman or sophomore, but 245, 250-pound juniors and seniors. So it's, it's a great, uh, great bonus for us. Now, on the other end of the spectrum, you also handle the uh, kickers, punters, um, mm -hmm. and long snapper, I guess you could say, uh, the specialists on this team. Um, people knew who DJ Sovin was before last season, but making that game-winning kick against Richmond, I think, made maybe made people take a little bit more notice, and he looks like he's come back stronger as well. Sure. It's, it's funny. When you're a specialist, you may only get six plays a game, and if you're not 100% perfect in those six plays, you're overlooked. Well, DJ had a really good true sophomore season. He's only going to be a true junior now, and we're expecting a lot of him. He's got, he's got a, a big opportunity in front of him, and we, we expect him to live up to that opportunity. So we're excited about it, absolutely. You had a true freshman punter last year in R.J. Peppers who, if people didn't know, if he wasn't wearing a, or I guess if he wasn't your punter, he might be able to double as maybe like a defensive line. I mean, he's a big kid, and yeah. he's got a big leg. Yeah, RJ uh, had an off-season mission to lose weight, and he lost 30 pounds and, and came back into camp later than he did as a true freshman. His flexibility's through the roof. He's doing a tremendous job, and we're excited. Uh, our offense last year was, was averaged, I want to say, around 28 points a game, and RJ only had 36 attempts last season, none blocked. It was a very successful freshman showing. We expect better as a sophomore, though. I'm sure you'd hope that that number could maybe go down a little a little further. I won't be upset if we punt less, I gotta tell you. It takes a lot of, I, I stop getting white hairs. It's not bad. Punt less and throw to your tight ends, right? Hey, let's do it. Hey, you know what? Whatever's gonna get us the W. Let's do it. Hey, Tiger Town. Towson football is back. Be a part of the uproar and get your tickets today. See the Tigers take on the William & Mary Tribe in the home opener presented by PNC Saturday, September 15th at noon in Johnny United Stadium. Enjoy the excitement of Tiger football, championship banner day, and hometown heroes. It's the Tigers home opener against William & Mary September 15th at noon in Johnny United Stadium. For tickets, visit TowsonTigers.com or call 1-855-TU-TIGER. Don't miss out. <laughs>